jealousy in the mind of Peter. Well, Peter was a hypocrite. It says that in his hypocrisy, he carried away Barnabas after they had agreed to go among the Gentiles, Barnabas, Paul's friend. I am sure that the conclusion of Peter was this. Listen, if we don't eliminate this man from the face of the earth, they're going to eliminate all of us, and he's going to stay with the Gentiles and the gospel of the Gentiles. We need to eliminate him. And I, from this pulpit, to all the nations with evidence, I want to show where Peter and the rest of the elders plotted to kill Paul. They said, this man we must eliminate. Quickly, let's go to the book of Acts, chapter 23. Quickly, Acts 23, verse 12 through 15. Look at what they did with Paul. And when it was day, some of the Jews, some of the what? Band together and bond themselves under an oath, saying that they would neither eat nor drink till they had killed Peter. Whom? Death to Paul. There were more than 40 that had formed this conspiracy. They came to the chief priest and whom? The elders maintain that word elders in your mind. And the elders saying, we have bond ourselves on a great oath that we will eat nothing until we have killed Paul. They went to whom? They went to the elders in the prior verse, right? They went to the elders. They went to the chief priests and elders. And you may say, no, but those priests were false. They weren't believers. And those elders, who were they? Notice that they were the same, the same so-called Christians that in chapter 1, so you can confirm it there in verse 17, you can see they're the same ones. Chapter 21, verse 17, And when we had come to Jerusalem, Paul is speaking here, the brethren received us gladly. And on the following day, Paul went in with us to James and all the elders, all the whom? The elders were present. So the elders are friends with James. And who is James? Jacob? Were they the same ones that fast and plotted Paul's death? I accuse from this pulpit, I declare historical written words that those who killed Paul in Rome were Peter, John, James, and the rest of the elders. And they did it, they did it wickedly in their hearts to preach a false gospel to all the Gentiles. And for 2,000 years, they have deceived, they have bewitched with a false gospel, the Gentile nations. The people have been deceived. Rome is to blame for deceiving the world. The evangelicals, every Christian group that are with the 11 apostles are contaminated with the same blaspheme. 